Looks like you have a secret admirer. Oh, that actually worked. All right. Wow! This is... Uh... Explicit. I know. <clears throat> and the perfume. It's so... Awful. Alluring! Wait for me in room 4C. What's this post for me while I'm gone? Of course. Sure. And don't go in there, Mr. Ackerman. Wouldn't dream of it. With the guard gone, I can see if there's any evidence in Lady Underwald's quarters. So we are immediately, not only are we dreaming of going in here, we're actually going in here. It's hard to see her like this. One moment, you're running an empire. The next, you're rolled up in an ugly rug. Like a sad hot dog. A monstera plant? Um, uh, retirement gift from La for a Lady Underworld. Oh, her walking cane. This could come in handy. Hope you don't mind, Lady Enterwald. It's a long stick-like thing I can probably use to grab her will with. She'd probably be fine with it. Half-empty briefcase. Her hat. A retirement gift. Multiple retirement gifts. I guess that's kind of it in here. All right, so we'll head back to the uh, room. Only room that we have access to, well, the room that has the thing in it is this room. And unfortunately, oh, I thought that other guy was going to be here, but okay. Should be able to reach the will with this, but I'll need some way to hook onto it. Oh, I see. Uh, combine it. Loose, I've loosely attached the wire to the stick to create a hook. But I'll need something else to secure it in place. Oh, okay. So what do we need for that? Uh, nope. Huh. Okay, so we need some sort of sticky thing? Or tape or something? Hmm. Don't think we have anything like that here. Okay. Nothing but sleeper carriages, okay. Besides, there's a killer on the loose. Okay, so we got this thing, but we need something to glue it together with. Hmm. <clears throat> I wonder. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. What do we have around here that we could use? I'm not sure. So I was wandering around in here trying to look at stuff I can uh, look at, and it's it's a bit of pixel hunting. And look, right here, I can pick up petals for reasons. So I think if I give these petals to the uh, bar guy, I can he can make me that drink, right? That's how that works. Here, flower petals in your face. Take them. Take that. Would these petals do? Hmm. I can work with that. No, I can't legally give you the real deal if you're anywhere under 200 pounds. Your liver would give in. So, what can you give me? I'll make you a rosebud light. It has all the flavor of the rosebud. But you'll still be able to live, you know, form sentences. 
Precisely. Also breathe and live. And that sort of thing. It's delicious. I might be able to make us uh, make it stronger for some experimentation. Oh dear. Something to mix it all up in. Oh, oh dear. So the rosebud light. Can't use them together. Um, something to mix them together in. Possible. I'm thinking of like a flower vase, and I know we have some in our room, but we also have some in the uh, Lady Unterwald's room. Nope. Nope. Use use this together. So no, I don't think that's the case. Maybe the sink. Nope. Okay. Hmm. Maybe there's something in the in Lady Unterwald's room still that we need to look at. Maybe I do need to do more pixel hunting here. I didn't want to talk to you. I'm very sorry. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll have to see. What do we got here? A vase I can use? Is there a vase I can use to mix drinks in? There's her hat. Hmm. I didn't see anything there. I need to do pixel hunting then, I guess. Wait a tick. Wait a tick. Huh. Oh, I see. I see. Ma amazing goblet. Okay. If there wasn't some way to seal it. So we have to seal it. It wasn't so gross. I heard that. So, we have this hearing horn. Slightly used ear horn. Corking device. So that's not an uncorker, that's a corking device. So... Ta-da! The horn is now sealed. That's a start. And a few more ingredients. Okay, so wine. I think I need one more ingredient. Coffee, wasn't it? That's it. All right. Glug glug. Oh dear. Okay, here goes nothing. Hmm. I don't feel any different. Oh no, the screen is fading to black. Ten minutes later. And Shui, you're my best friend. Yes, Arthur. We're all very pleased that you're finally having a good time. But I can't understand a word you're saying. <laughs> None of us can. Oh, wow. Must be drunk. Was shop. You're scaring me. He's scaring me more. Not this again. What's up? I can't understand you, sorry. What's up? <laughs> sorry, old chuff. Can't understand a word you're saying. 
What's up? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> What'll it be? Uh, never mind. What's up? <laughs> Very good, sir. What's up? What? No, really. What? What's up? My god. How much alcohol have you consumed? All right, let's let's get down to business. Wah! My good man. Are you enjoying my signature drink? Well, we can f understand what he's saying. You finally sobered up? Wah! <laughs> of course not. We're just the same amount of drunk. Oh. I guess that makes sense. Sort of? Herman Merman said he saw you earlier in the evening. Uh, yes, he did. Not long before he lost his quiche. Ah, oh, most definitely. I was well aware of that defective detective. Crashing and bashing about his quarters last night. And let me ask him this. Who came up with this rosebud stuff? Who came a uh, shop with the Shrewsbud stuff? Anyhow, <laughs> the French. All right. Anyway, uh, tell me about the crashing and bashing, the crashing and the bashing you heard. Oh, it was awful. Drove me to drink and despair. It did. Well, I was already drinking. <laughs> I got my revenge though. Dropped three in the hallway. The the she took the in when he wasn't looking. He Herman's room keys. She here, take him, lad. And make sure you crack the case. You might want to show her up first though. How does one sober up? I don't know. We'll figure out. Are we still drunk? What's up? Can't understand you. Alright. We're still very drunk. How does one sober up? Right. Herman's missing keys. Nope, nope. I should show her up. Okay, how does one do that? Um, how does one sober up? Is it like magic? Do you wash your face? Maybe we talk to the bartender again and he gives us another drink that makes us less, you know, crazy. Less drunk? Possibly. Hey you. What's up? What'll it be? Uh, strong coffee, please. Strong coffee. Looks like you need a really strong coffee. Are we... Are we... Are we good now? Are we good? Ouch, my head is killing me. Hope I didn't embarrass myself. You totally did. I made sure of it. <laughs> Alright. So, let's... Why not? 
Oh, I see. We have to... Okay. We just click on the door. Wow, this place has been trashed. Someone must have been looking for something. Recently smashed mirror. Punched pillow. They, they, they went out of the way to punch the pillow explicitly. Uh, what's this? Uh, Herman Merman and the Uncertain Surgeon. Uh, murmuring German. Or the Murmuring German. Discarded cushion. Knocked over a lamp. Okay, but there's got to be something in here for us, right? Torn window blind. Hmm. Oh, briefcase. A locked briefcase. Okay. Uh, what? What? That's a snug fit. Maybe I can find someone or something to break it open. Hmm. Okay. Maybe we ask around. Hi. How can I help you, Arthur? Tell me what to do! Ask around. I'm sure someone can help you with your case. Thanks. Oh! This guy's gone. Sleazeball is gone. Where's he gone to? This is his room. He's not in here, though. Technically, didn't the guard go to the room that the sleazeball was in as well? Grilled beef and veggies. Hmm. Hi. Ah, Arthur. Can you believe it? What a mess. My feelings exactly. Uh... Nope. Nothing there. What about you? Hello again. Uh... Nothing new there either. And you guys... I was a favorite. I was a favorite. You're above sock. Alright. What about you? What'll it be? Uh, never mind. Alright. Cool. What about you? Good evening, sir. Uh... Are you so good to ruin an old lady's fun? Is this about the horn? What? I'm going to leave now. Here. Sure, you wouldn't want it back now that I've sealed it. Oh. It's a combination lock. Oh. You need to break it open somehow. So, we need some way to break that open? Hmm. Okay. Isn't this? No. Hello. Uh. No. Nah. The thing is that, like, there's only so many places we can be, and it feels like we need to either pick up another thing or talk to someone. But, like, two people have vanished. The guard has vanished, and the sleazeball have vanished since the beginning of this. Are they dead? I mean, that's entirely possible. Hmm. Use this on that. No, that's not gonna work. She wouldn't like that. She wouldn't like that. She wouldn't like that. Say, do either of you know anyone who could open this briefcase? It was in my pants. I'll give it a shot. Let me try first. No, he clearly asked me. I'm the best person for the job. 
the second best person for the job. You won't be saying that when I open it. Because I'd already have opened it. It's mine. 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 Oh, remember the, um, do you remember the, the, no, now look what you did. The purse that they tried to tear between them. This is what happened. I think my work here is done. All right. Oh, detective strength duct tape. Good. Anything else in there? Nope. Okay, so duct tape on this thing. And we now have a hook. Time to bring in that will from the cold. Alright. In here. And here. And here. Dun da da dun. Got it. Got it. Where there's a will, there's a way. What? That's right. Anything's possible. Herman Merman. But we all saw you die. Did you? Or did you watch a master at work? I have the will, Herman. It'll reveal the murderer. Indeed. That's what I'm afraid of. No! That's not true! That's impossible! It's true. Ambushed. Uh, in my own room! Quiet, you! Oh, sleazeball's in here! I'll find even smaller space to duct tape you in. Eep! The guard is in here, too. As for you, Arthur, shall we take this... Outside. Gulp. Part 3. Dispute Resolution. You've been th thrown in my sight since the moment we met. How so? It'll be a pleasure to kill you. No witnesses, after all. Wait. I have questions. Questions? What questions? Why did you kill Lady Unterwald? I spent years spying on her family. Reporting any and all indiscretions. If anyone so much as stepped out of line, she'd know about it. Also, she could keep her wrinkled hands clean. We had a deal. It was you that she wrote out of her will, wasn't it? Oh, yes. Lady Enterwald decided she was done with me. Felt remorse for all the un underhanded spying, she said. Written out, just like that. I merely returned the favor. Why the need to fake your death? Lady Underworld was already dead. I was ready to switch the original with a copy. Oh, the original will with a copy. Trusting that Lady Underworld's paranoia wouldn't ensure nobody had seen the original. Losing the will made things uh, complicated. I simply wasn't prepared for your uh, incompetence. Nobody suspects a dead man. I brought me some time. You trashed your room to throw off the scent? No, no, no. That was just me losing my temper. Anyway, time's up. Goodbye, Mr. Ackerman. Wait! What on earth are you doing? <laughs> what 
this happening? Prepare to buckle under justice. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I wonder what that Arthur boy is up to. I hope he took my advice about making new friends. I... What? Hello? Is anyone there? I have a note, my love. That's nice. But I'm very badly wounded. Why do you persist in living? Get back up here and face me. You whimpering simpleton. Throwing It's a tunnel. You know what that means. Yep. Looks like Herman came up short. I'm sorry, sir. We found Herman's body. Well, half of it. But we couldn't recover the will. That's okay, Mir Maurice. I have it right here. <gasps> but before I read the will, I want to say that I've really learned something here. What's that, Arthur? Uh, how to have a good time. Never again. Get on with it! Huh? The will reading. It reads as follows. Boot to the head. I, Lady Unterwald, being of sound mind and legal capacity, leave my entire estate to... Arthur Ackerman. What? You poisonous goat. You turned her against us. I... Oh, look. Another tunnel. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, this was a really short but silly game. It was kind. It was pretty fun, actually. It was enjoyable, and it made me laugh quite a few times. So that's good. Moral support, thanks to Dave Lloyd. Oh, okay. Made in two weeks. That this was made in two weeks. Wow. Okay. That's impressive, if this was made in two weeks. This was fun. This was a fun, nice little game. I think it's free. I'm pretty sure you can- I think it's one of those like you can choose to pay if you want to pay. And I'll try to put a link in the description. I think I did already, but I'll do so anyway. Anyway, this was nice and fun. Hope you'll join, join me in whatever is our next play. Bye bye!